Hi, Stephanie. I know you've asked me, uh, and I quote, how you inspire first-year students, and I'm going to uh, talk about you and uh, how I attempted to treat you uh, almost 20 years ago, although I never had you as a first-year undergraduate student, but I certainly did as a prized first-year graduate student. So, specifically, I attempted to inspire you by listening to you respectfully, making an effort to get to know you personally, communicating high expectations to you, praising you, never underestimating you, giving you both freedom and responsibility to show me, and most importantly yourself, what you could do by letting you know I loved you, professionally speaking that is, in, in only the way that I can love a student, by giving the gift of self, namely myself, and by making a lifetime commitment to be there for you, however you might need me. Now you also asked what inspired me as a first-year student. Well, really, it is who inspired me. And I was inspired by my second academic advisor because I fired the first academic advisor after he told me I was the stupidest kid he had ever advised. I was inspired by a sophomore student who was my academic salvation, who taught me how to teach notes. And you know who that is because you work for him at the University of South Carolina, Dan Berman. I was inspired by two professors in history and sociology who disrupted my understanding of the world around me and from which or after which I was never the same again. And I was inspired by another professor who told me I could become a good student if only I emulated him and read the New York Times daily, which I still do 55 years later. Thank you for asking, Stephanie.